Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel, and today we're going to be aquascaping this Aquatop 3 gallon long aquarium. So the tank itself is made by Aquatop. It's a 3 gallon long rimless aquarium that measures 18 inches long by about 7.5 inches tall and five and a half inches wide it fits perfectly on this little nano shelf that i have set up and i was super excited to get this going for my sparkling gourami first step was the substrate and this time i'm using tropica aquarium soil this is a little more high-end than i typically like to go but if any of you have been watching my videos recently you do know that i bought this and i had this specifically for this build so i decided to use this special tropica stuff and i'm excited to see how it does with my plants Hardscape was locally collected Grey River Stone that I pulled from the Spokane River. I'm not going for anything crazy or super substantial here. I want the plants to be the main focus of this design, but I wanted some little bit of hardscape to kind of pop out of the greenery. added a little bit of water to the scape at this point to make planting easier.
Alright everybody, that's the tank set up. I hope you enjoyed the video and the little scape. And my sparkling Grommy, he's really shy right now, just getting adjusted to his new home. He's actually currently right there. I doubt you guys could see him. Um, it's really hard to get video of him because he's skittish for everything, especially uh, the camera. But he's enjoying his life just in between the plants. And I'm excited to see how this fills in. Hopefully it comes in nicely. The plants have been doing really well. I've seen some pearling action later in the day like it is right now. If you keep your eye out, you might see some oxygen bubbles coming up. Just did a water change on the tank. And I'm going to keep up water changes uh, pretty much every day for another week or so just to make sure this tank gets established well. Um, I do think I added a little bit too much aqua soil on the front right here. Um, it's just a little bit deeper than that I would prefer. Um, it doesn't look super aesthetically pleasing, but I bet the plants will enjoy it. And so yeah, that's the build. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll give you guys more updates on this tank later. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.